I think of Ovid as one of the most painterly of all poets. Ovid always loves to set the scene, and even if you'd never seen Titian's paintings, I think in reading the Ovid, um, you immediately have an idea of place. He makes, he is so visual, and he makes you think visually in his descriptiveness, in the adjectives he uses, in the idea of touch and um, coolness, for example, the coolness of the, the grotto and the nakedness of the flesh, it, it's all so evocative. Um, Titian is almost the reverse of that. Um, he is the most poetic of painters, and so in many, many ways, it's um, an ideal meeting of minds between, between these two very gifted men. Ovid has a way of making poetry enjoyable, and I think um, Titian was a master of that as well. He, he certainly knew how to spin an extraordinary tale in, in a painting, and he did that um, uh, through the gaze, through touch. Um, for example, the nymph's um, foot in the icy stream, he makes us feel its, um, its cool freshness and so on. Um, he employs everything in his armory, if you like. Many of those um, tools or, or weapons, shall we say, um, are borrowed from poetry. So, for example, I, I think there's a lot about um, rhyme, rhythm, um, contrast, sort of antithesis. Um, and uh, surprise, all the tactics that Ovid employed. Um, Titian kind of recreates them in his own special style, which is particularly humane. I think if people call Titian's work poetic, that they're talking about poetic in the right way, which is that he uses enormous precision and depth to bring about something very, very human, rather than create something romantic or epic. And I think Titian's ability to, to draw out um, essential human qualities in whichever figure he depicted um, is what moved me most. And this character moved me most, Callisto, because of this incredible focus on her belly. Um, it doesn't mean, he doesn't objectify her belly. He actually invests everything in it as, he invests the act of the gods in it. The whole story is there in this very, very human, swelling body. These pictures are completely um, unprecedented um, in terms of their scope, the cast of characters, the psychological in interplay between the characters. Um, and Titian was self-conscious about this. Um, he, he was the first one to call these paintings poesie, poems. And um, he realized that he had um, achieved something very special.